yeah, when I look back now, of course, when it was hard work, so and there were a few moments where the, the game could have changed it. I thought we, we really deserved winner. We did a, we played a really good football game. Start was not that good. We we changed system, and obviously. The one thing what is then new is a little bit of situation on the on the on the wing, and um, the big chance they had when in the second post area, yeah, um, we did not that good in this moment. So, but then they couldn't score. Then we controlled the game. Then we spent, then we scored the goal. Um, we had another big chance with the header. We were, yeah, we were the dominant side. Then um, they had absolutely one of the biggest chances I ever saw in my life. So we didn't score. That was a lucky moment for us. Start in the second half was brilliant. We played really good football. Then we were more direct. We used uh, the information from first half and the information from the halftime. We analyze uh, when we said we a few different moves, so two different, a few different um, surprising um, movements and better timing in, in passing and running. It's easy to say, much more difficult to do. But the boys did really brilliant, and then we so we, we scored the goals, controlled the game. Um, could have scored more often. But that's completely okay that we didn't. And um, yeah, how is that? Perfect afternoon. Jurgen, you spoke in the build-up to the game about moving to playing Chris Pacino and Griffin Waldo and other ways while you were the show today. I, I, I thought I spoke about the future, didn't I? Was it? I can't remember actually when I said this, but um, it was always clear that Phil can play this. That's no doubt. Um, um, if he starts at the wing, he's very often in this position. Oh, he's, uh, um, he was never a winger. He's always kind of a playmaker. It's not interesting where he's coming from. It's always he, you, he needs to be at one point. He needs to be in the, in the decisive area in the middle of the park. He needs to be in shooting situations and all that stuff. So in finishing situations, that's what he did today. Obviously, he felt really well in this position, and um, yeah, it was a good game. Obviously, a good signer. Eh? So we, that's how it is. A part of our life is to handle pressure, to 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 ignore the bad part of pressure and to use the good part of pressure. So that's that's our job. And um, I I thought we did really well. It was not if you you play. You we drew in the last game, so we didn't finish. A, we didn't score with a penalty. Maybe people says then yeah, so they can't deal with pressure. But um, if. The only sign for is using a penalty or not, if you can deal with pressure or not. These players did um, so good this season that we are in the situation we are. So it's a 73 points. You, nobody makes make you 73 points as a present. So take it and use it. We had to work for it. The boys did it. And today I thought we saw really a, um, a convincing performance. So I have no doubts about anything. But the first sentence players said in the dressing room was, well, um, um, one more time, one more game. We will, we will, um, we will stay focused 100%. And, and um, so we know about the situation. We know about the difficulty of the of the next game. Nobody will go in this game and underestimate one, and one percentage. Middlesbrough, they had a hard season. They had, uh, they. It's hard in the in the season like this to enjoy football. I'm pretty sure they won't enjoy football at Enfield. They want to try everything to play good football, and that makes life difficult for us. But if we can be as focused as today, and if we can be as fluent and and have good movements as today, then then it will be difficult. But first of all, we have to train. We have first to recover, then to prepare, and then to find a. Um, the, the, the lineup for the game, and um, hopefully Roberto is c coming back, so um, would give us another option. But so for today, it was we couldn't do, we couldn't have done better. What do you think? Yeah, <laughs> uh, obviously he was the player. So unfortunately, he was not that often available. But um, it's all good. So since he, I thought his timing is brilliant, Roberto out, Daniel. Best training week, really good, part of everything, um, and um, yeah, fantastic game of him. No, 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 no not a real idea, but it's, it's a bigger chance than for this game today. So we we we, we tried a little bit on Friday.
only with a little running, he still felt the muscles. No, no, no chance. We know, you know, he's, he struggled a little bit in the last few weeks with different parts of his body. So we always had to manage intensity with him, and they did. And then the game actually didn't really feel it. It was, um, and then after the game, he said, "Yes, now I feel something," and that was too much for for, for training last week. But um, another week, and um, being an option would be cool for us. Thanks, guys. Thank you very much. See you.